Hello. Hello, Kyo. Is that uh, how I pronounce your name? Uh, yes, uh, I'm Kyo. It's nice to meet you. Oh, nice to meet you, Kyo. Are you new with Kalingo? Uh, yeah, this is uh, my first time to use Kalingo. Oh. Wow! First <laughs> class with me. I should be privileged. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. So where are you coming from? Uh, I'm from Japan, but uh, I live in uh, San Francisco right now because um, I study English. Uh -huh. Excellent. So you're, are you so are you studying English in San Francisco as your main field, or are you studying something else as well as English? Uh, yeah, I study English and go to school. Uh huh. Excellent. And how are you finding America? Uh, sorry. How are you finding America, the U.S.? Do you like it? Yeah, I like it. Uh huh. Yeah. Have you met many friends and everything? Hello, yeah. Kyo. Is that how I pronounce your name? Oh, uh, yes, echoing. Uh, Kyo. <laughs> it's nice to meet you. Oh, nice Wait. to meet you, Kyo. Kyo. Are you with you have two windows open. Uh, yeah, this is uh, my first time to oh. use Kalingo. Oh. Yeah. Wow. You, see, first you might have two speaking. Kalingo windows open. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> so okay, where are you? So you will have to close one uh, of them, Theo. Uh, okay. Okay. Yes. Try that. That right usually because, is um, okay. the case. It's okay. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Let me talk now. Yes. Yes. That's Sorry. fine. Just because you're probably watching maybe something else and you have another Kalingo window open, you have to close that one before you start a new class, okay? Just to let okay, you know. I, okay, I got it. Okay, and we have another person. Hello, Nui as well. Oh, you have a nice long name. Mm -hmm. At Sor uh, At Atsu. Soro. At Soro. Atsu. Oh, it's Atsu. nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. And where nice are you coming you. from? I'm from Japan. Japan. We have a few students from Japan. <laughs> and you will love them. They are amazing. We have Heidi, Ken, a few more is coming in as well. Excellent. Oh, it's so good to have new faces. Yeah. <laughs> is this your first time as well, Atsoro? Yes, I'm um, first time. First time as well. Oh my God, I feel even more privileged <laughs> to be the first <laughs> teacher. Um, well, welcome to Kalingo, both of you guys. Mm -hmm. And um, we have Sam as well as a Sam. Yes, hello, Sam. How are you? Hello, today? hello, teacher. Hello, teacher. Hello. <laughs> How's things with you in Hong Kong? Uh, uh, it's very well. The weather is not too cold. About around uh, 17 degrees. Oh, 17 degrees, did you say? Yes, yes. Oh, very That's hot. That's not cold. That's hot. <laughs> you should try oh. seven. <laughs> In the UK, we are six degrees. And it's very windy outside. Very, very, very windy. And I'm mm. scared that my bins will be blown away. Because... <laughs> <laughs> The wind is quite strong here in the UK, um, and we are predicting snow as well. Um, do you guys like snow? Um, yeah, um, in San Francisco, it's getting cold. Uh -huh. Yeah, yeah. But uh, no get, snow. No snow, yeah. Yes. <laughs> I'm not sure about San Francisco getting snow, yeah. yeah. Um, what about in Japan? Um, how are you coping with the cold at Soro? Uh, Japan is cold. Cold, yeah. Cold. Uh -huh. Yeah, you must be keeping warm then, <laughs> preparing for <laughs> winter time. <laughs> excellent, excellent. Well, guys, um, if you, what I'll do because it is your first lesson, I will get you guys to introduce each other. Mm -hmm. And say hi. Um, so we'll start with um, Keo. Okay, you want to mm -hmm. introduce yourself? Maybe tell us a bit about yourself. What do you like to do? Why yeah. did you join Kalingo? Okay. Okay. Um, I'm from Japan, and uh, um, I study English uh, in San Francisco right now, and uh, I go to English school. Uh, so um, um, I. 
Mm, I joined the calling uh, two hours ago uh, in order to improve my English skill because mm -hmm. I want to start a new business in San Francisco. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What type of business, Sam Kyo, if you don't mind uh, um, me asking? Yeah, um, I'm looking for a next business idea. Uh, yeah, please let me know the next big thing. <laughs> wow, that's cool. Well, welcome on board, Kyo. Yeah, okay, thank Sora, you. We'll, <laughs> we'll start with you, Sora, if you want to introduce yourself to everybody. And Soro, can you hear me? Yes. Yes. You want to say hi to everybody? Um, what do you like to do? What sports you like to do? Why do you want to learn English? English. I, mm, I'm studying English. Mm, I have to speak English. <laughs> so <laughs> I'm reading mm -hmm. and uh, listening every day. But mm -hmm. I don't have um, op opportunity for speaking. Okay, well hopefully with Kalingo you will be confident and you will be speaking English within a month. So yeah, so welcome on board at Zorro. Now we have Sam, Sam if you want to introduce yourself. Now Sam has been with us for, Sam how long have you been with us? Oh, about two weeks. Two, two weeks. weeks. Uh -huh. yes. Okay. okay, so Sam is um, still new to Kalingo. So Sam, you want to introduce yourself? Uh, hello, I am I'm Sam. I'm from Hong Kong. Mm -hmm. I, uh, I I learn English with uh, I want to visit the uh, London to see the museum, the church, and the palace. Mm -hmm. Buckingham yes. Palace. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you can't forget Buckingham Palace now. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you, Sam. And then we have Adam as well, guys. Um, Adam's been with us for how long, Adam? Hi. <laughs> Hello. Mm -hmm. Hi, everybody. Uh, I'm with Colingo about two weeks, I think, or something like that. Are but you sure uh, two weeks? Yeah, oh, yeah. No. Maybe, maybe three, but uh, I. Uh, I had a problem with my computer, so I, I took uh, five classes maybe only. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah. So you're still newie as well to the system, yeah. Adam? Yeah. Excellent. Okay, guys. So we are all um, getting to know each other now in this first lesson. Adam and Sam, it's um, Keo and Atsoro's first lesson today, okay? So we will take it slow. And my name, guys, is Sakina. I'm based in the UK. I'm from Northern Ireland, and it is part of the UK. This is why I don't have the British accent. So you're probably wondering, how come she's from the UK, but she doesn't have the British accent? That's very mm -hmm. strange. I get students always asking me that. So this is the reason, because I come from Northern Ireland, so it's a bit of a different accent. Okay guys, so we will get stuck into the lesson, okay guys? Um, so today we're going to be talking about um, TV and film mm -hmm. and the movie The End of Harry Potter. Okay, The End of Harry Potter. Do you guys like to watch Harry Potter? Are you a fan? Yeah, of course, yes of course. I love it. Excellent. So this lesson will be perfect for you, Keo. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> what about at Sorrow? Harry Potter? No. You no. don't like Harry Potter? <laughs> yeah, some people, they either like it or hate it. You know, it's just one of them movies. Um, it, it's just fantasy, really, isn't it? Okay. And Adam, do you like Harry Potter? Yes, no? Not really. I, I've seen the uh, first uh, part, uh, Philosophic Stone, I think. Uh -huh. It's okay, but uh, but I I love uh, fantasy films, uh, movies, mm. but mm -hmm. but Harry Potter is not for me. I think. Yeah, yeah. Not really. But I it's, think it's, it's, it's it's not uh, bad, uh, but. Yeah, yeah. I think out of all of them, I think Lord of the Rings was the best. 
No oh, Lord okay. of the Rings. Yeah. Amazing. Amazing. <laughs> it took me a whole year to finish the three movies. <laughs> because each one is two hours. I'm like, oh my god, this movie is too long. But when you watch it, guys, you don't even realize the time is going. It's like, oh my god, it's finished already? You get so into it. Yeah. That's so pretty cool. And then some. What about you, Harry Potter? Are you a fan? Harry Potter. Uh, Harry Potter I just uh, see the. I just see the first uh, movie mm -hmm. uh, of Harry Potter. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. How did you find it? Did you like it? Mm, I think I don't. I, I don't like Harry Potter. I don't like don't Harry Potter. <laughs> 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 so I think it's just me and you, Keo, that are that have an interest for Harry Potter. <laughs> just the two of us. Okay, well, this is what we're going to talk about today, an article. Um, but before we get into the article, we're going to do grammar, okay, guys? Um, and our grammar is going to be future questions, how to construct future questions, and um, look at some examples and construct some examples as well with using future questions. Um, so before we get started, um, I want to give you guys a little scenario. So something that I am planning to do at the weekend, okay? And I want you guys to think of questions to ask me about my plans for the weekend. So my plans for the weekend, I'm going to have a big dinner party and um, I'm looking forward to my big dinner party. So I want you guys to ask me questions about my dinner party. Like For example, um, who's going to your dinner party? Okay, etc. So who would like to want to know about my dinner party? Who would like to start asking questions? Any questions? Don't be shy, guys. Yes. Uh, how about your uh, how about the interest in your dinner party? Uh-huh. Interest? Yes, interest in your uh, dinner party. I didn't get the first part of the question. I heard interest. Can you type it in some? Please, yeah. I think that's better. Yeah. Yeah. When I have difficulty here, and I'll just get you guys to type it in. Mm -hmm. You'll be one of the lucky ones. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. So while um, someone's typing that in, who would like to ask another question? Okay. I can ask a question. Mm -hmm. uh, what do you bring to a party? What will you bring to a party? I will bring lots of things, Keo. Mm -hmm. I will bring yes. drinks and mm -hmm. um, snacks. Mm -hmm. I will also have meat at the barbecue. I'm going to have a little barbecue as well. Mm -hmm. And I will have lots of meat around, surrounding um, lots of chocolate, because I love chocolate. And I know my <laughs> friends love chocolate. <laughs> and lots of um, coffee, because I love coffee as well. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah, that's pretty much it, yeah. Oh, interesting. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I will try and make it interesting. <laughs> okay, very good question. What about you, Atsoro? All right. Um, who is going to this party? Who is going to this party? Who? Right. Well, this will be a tricky question because I don't want to invite everybody at Zorro. So I will probably invite my closest friends and my family. Oh. Um, maybe a couple of my next door neighbors. Yeah. Can little, I join yeah. your party? Can of I join course, it's it? so. You can get the plane to Northern Ireland, no problem. Yes. <laughs> no yeah, problem. You'll be too far from Japan. <laughs> I, I will send you guys an invitation, okay? <laughs> excellent, excellent question. Okay, some you've put your question. Very good, some. What is the interest in your dinner party? Ah, good question. Well, we will probably play lots of games at the party. Um, you know, challenging games, maybe do something outdoor as well. Yeah. 
not sure yet, but I'm probably thinking that I will do this. Yeah. What about you, Adam? Thank you, Sam. Good question. I wanted to ask you, uh, are you going uh, to ask, uh, invite us for your uh, dinner <laughs> party? But <laughs> uh, I saw a bit you to it. Yes. <laughs> so I will ask, uh, uh, will you have uh, um, dancing at your uh, dinner party? Yes, I think I will. I'll have a, a bit of dancing, yes. Yes, yeah. I don't know who's going to be the DJ, but I'll do something, yeah. <laughs> To make it fun. <laughs> to make it fun. Yeah. So there you go, guys. This is my weekend booked. Now, it's not really what my weekend's going to be like. This is just a, a pretend scenario. So you guys are probably thinking it's real. No, it's not real. <laughs> because in the, it's winter time now, so I don't think we will be doing anything outside. So, yeah, it's too cold in the UK. It's very, very cold. And everybody is staying indoors. So, yeah. Great questions, guys. That was a little warm up for you guys to get into the mood of grammar. And let's focus on our grammar now. So, what I will do, I will screen share um, the document for you guys to see. And uh, just bear with me, guys, till I put this across. I'm still getting used to the new Hangouts, believe it or not, guys. Oh, God. Okay. Right. I think I've got it here. Okay. I'll make it a bit bigger. Can you guys see this? Yeah. On the okay. screen? Yeah. Excellent. Excellent. Okay. So, guys, what we're going to do today, we're going to read about future questions. Um, have you guys um, learned this before? Uh, Keo, have you learned future questions before at school? Yes, um, I learned uh, about the future question. Mm -hmm. Excellent, excellent. At Soro, future questions? First time? One more, please. Oh, first time, okay. I think it's your first time, yeah? Yes, first time. Okay, okay. And Adam, I think you've done this before, haven't you? Yeah, no, I'm, I, I'm familiar with that. Oh, excellent. So you can give us lots of nice examples, Adam. <laughs> <laughs> You're in trouble today. No. <laughs> I'm only joking. Okay, Sam, what about you? Is this your first time doing future questions? Yes, first time. Oh, goody. Okay, no, it's not that hard, guys. It's not that hard. So let's read about future questions. Okay. Okay, so first you can use will for future questions. That's the first thing that we can do. And the construction, so to create a future question, we have the will plus subject, which can be the I, she, Joe, plus verb, and plus optional time phrase. So we need a time phrase in relation to week or month, year, etc. Okay, so for example, Will you go to work tomorrow? Will you send an email? Okay. You can use going to for future questions. And to construct this, we use am, is, or are, plus subject, plus verb. And, of course, your optional time phrase. So, for example, with using the going to, we have are they going to are they going to go to the party this weekend? Mom, am I going to get a kitten? Okay. And third, you can form future questions with the present continuous, such as the ing. And to construct these questions with the ing is is, am, um, are, this is the to be verb, plus subject, plus a verb ing and of course your optional time phrase okay for example are Jenny and May buying groceries is Luke driving to university tomorrow okay and that's pretty much it guys with the future questions we have three points um, that we use. We have will, going to, and then using the present continuous. So 
can I maybe ask you guys to try giving me an example of using a future question. So we'll start off with Will. <clears throat> Will. So we have two examples here. Okay. Who would like to try a future question? Who would like to try some? Yeah. Would you like to try forming a future question? Okay. Will you yeah. go to study uh, this week? Will I go to study this week? Yes, very good. Yep. Yeah. Good. Okay. Adam, what about you? Mm. Will you bake a cake for your dinner party? Oh, good, Adam. Yeah, excellent. And I don't think I'll bake a cake, Adam. I don't like <laughs> baking. <laughs> oh. <laughs> it takes too much time. Cooking is already time consuming, so. I, no. <laughs> I, I can bake a, 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 a apple pie for you. Oh, can you, Adam? Oh, that would be great. <laughs> oh, you're more than welcome to come to my party. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> okay. And Atsoro, what about you? Can you think of a question? Will you go to the party? Well, will I go to the party? Will you uh -huh. go to the party? Go to go party? Will you go to... I didn't hear you. It's just the last part there. Will you go to party? Will I go to the party? Yeah, okay, good. Yes, will you go to the party? Good, good. Yeah, that's fine. And Joshua, we have Joshua in the house. How are you, Joshua? Tina. Yay. How are you? What's up? Yeah. <laughs> I'm good. I'm eating mango. Oh, why are you making me jealous now? <laughs> <laughs> well, Joshua, listen, you've just came at the right time on our yeah. grammar. Yeah. That's good. That's and good. And you are so lucky because I'm going to ask you a grammar question with relation into future. Future oh. questions. Yep. <laughs> Have you done future <laughs> questions before? No, I haven't. Oh. I think it's my first time. Yeah. First time. With okay. Okay, well, maybe observe for a bit, and then I can ask you later on. How's that? And you can finish eating your mango. Yeah, okay. thank you. <laughs> okay, guys, very good. Okay, so you guys have formed a question using will. Okay, so let's try going to. Can anyone think of a question with using going to? Uh, have a pen to go. Going to some. <clears throat> Can you think of anything? Going to. Going to. Are you going to watch uh, the latest uh, part of Harry Potter? Oh, good. Yes, Adam. I know I'm not going to watch <laughs> the latest of Harry Potter because I've no time. Very good, Adam. Okay. Atsuro, can you think of one? Or are you still thinking? Take your time. I, are you going to uh, go to restaurant tonight? Mm, I'm not sure, Atsuro. It depends. <laughs> How busy I am. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent question. Okay. Um, Sam, can you think of one? Uh, are you going to buy a stick uh, from the market? Are you going to buy a stick, stick peas from the market? Am I going to get peas from the market? Yes. Um, no, I don't think so, Sam. I can get it from the supermarket instead of the market. Yes. Yeah. Thank you, Sam. That's a great question. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So, Joshua, can you think of one? So, basically, forming a question with using will or going to. Okay. 
if you teach another class um, later this day? Yes, I will. All right. All right. I will, Joshua. Cool. cool. <laughs> Good question. Good question. Okay. So now I want you guys to think of another question and ask each other a question. So, for example, at Soro, you will think of a question for either Joshua, Sam, or Adam with using will or going to. It's up to you which one you want to use. And the same for the rest. So Joshua, you can think of a question to ask the rest of them as well. And I will give you a minute to think of that, okay? So you guys are going to ask each other a question with using the feature. Okay. Everybody understand? Yes? Yes. Okay, good. Okay, goody, goody. When you guys are ready, just say, I'm ready, and then we can... I'm ready. Oh, Adam, <laughs> <laughs> you're quick. <laughs> okay, Adam, who is the question for? Uh, okay, so it's a question for Atshuro. Yeah, Atshuro. Mm -hmm. okay. yeah. Am I spelled correctly? Uh, okay, so uh, Atshuro, uh, are you going to stay with Kolingo in the future? Yes. I I I continue Kringle. Go. I decide to continue Kringle. Go. Okay. Excellent. I will decide to continue I with Kalingo. I will yeah. decide to continue to Kalingo. Yeah, to continue with Kalingo. Yes, very good, it's oral. Very good question, Adam. Very good question. Um, who else has a question? I know Joshua is still eating his mango, and he haven't he hasn't offered us any. I'm heartbroken. I didn't know. Um. I'm very quiet here because <laughs> <laughs> I can hear you stuffing your face, I'm with Mango. <laughs> I'm enjoying. I'm enjoying it. Do you hear him, guys? He's just stuffing himself <laughs> with the mango. <laughs> oh dear. Okay, I'll leave you alone, Joshua. Okay, Sam, can you think of a question to ask anybody, or do you need more time? Joshua. Mm. Uh, will you go into the countryside uh, this week? Good question. Joshua, you'll have to answer that one. <laughs> okay. Um, Sam. Is that Sam, yeah. correct? Okay. Uh, no, I'm not going to the countryside this next week or this week because yeah I'm a bit busy um, I just like uh, staying at home and then you know chatting with Colingo teachers and students wow. as well yeah. wow very good <laughs> very good <laughs> thank you <laughs> yeah <laughs> chatting with them while eating mango <laughs> Yes, of course. That's what Josh is good at, yes. Chatting, chatting. <laughs> he wants to really improve his English, guys. So, yeah. Yes. Excellent, Sam. Thank you for that. Okay, Atsoro, um, did you manage to think of one? It's okay if you don't, because it is your first lesson. I don't want to overburden you. Adam, uh, will you... Uh, by the car. <laughs> Will you buy a car? Car. Yeah. I won't buy a car in the future because, uh, or I, I'm uh, not going to buy a car because I have a new one. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, excellent. Um, 
just maybe with the time phrase at Soro, uh, at Soro, don't forget to put maybe, are you going to buy a car tomorrow, next week, okay? In the next few days, etc. Because that is relating to future. Okay. But guys, excellent questions. Can I Joshua, ask? Now your turn. Sam? Yes. Sam, can you buy me a mango? Ah, sorry, will will you buy me a mango? Buy <laughs> me a mango. Yeah. Will you buy me a mango? I prefer the banana. What? I prefer the banana. I don't want to buy the mango. Oh, you don't. Know. I like to eat the banana. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are funny. Did you? What fruit did you say? Vanilla? Yes, banana. Yeah. Van vanilla. <laughs> Never heard of that fruit. Oh, I think he's he's re he's referring to vanilla, just like vanilla ice cream. You know, vanilla <laughs> ice cream. Oh, right. Yeah. Now I get you. <laughs> <laughs> but mango is just as tasty. Mango is very tasty. I love mango. Yeah, mm. but I think it's good to dip mango into vanilla ice cream as well. Yeah, that's. Yeah, mm. that's true. Oh yeah. <laughs> that's oh, mango and taste vanilla if I ice tried that. cream. Yeah. <gasps> that sounds divine. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Excellent. Okay, guys. So let's move on to the next part. Um. Okay. So the next part, the last one. Okay. So we've built a question using will and going to. So I want you guys to think of a question with the ing present continuous okay so you're going to use the to be verb plus the subject and the verb ing and don't forget to put your optional time phrase in there as well okay okay so who would like to start the question mm. and who would you like to ask some this is going yeah. to be with someone here Can I ask you? Me? <laughs> <laughs> Some? Okay, you can ask me. Are you are you uh, uh, are you going to study uh, next next month? In the next month, next am I going to study next month? Yes, I am going to study next month. Yes. yes. <laughs> Great. Great. Okay. Who's next? Adam, you want to try? Okay, so I have a question for Joshua. Mm -hmm. uh, and Joshua, what do you think? Uh, is Sikina uh, drinking at her uh, dinner party? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Let's what see what the Joshua answers. Okay, Joshua. What was the question? Sorry. Uh, is Sikina drinking at her uh, dinner party? Mm. Don't forget. Uh, yeah, she, I, I, I just want to. She's probably going. She's probably it, going to drink kopi. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> because because before she said she love, you know, she loved drinking kopi. Yeah, yeah. Probably she going to drink kopi. <laughs> yes, that's right, Joshua. I don't drink. But, the, but that the but the question is what what type of kopi she like is that. Cappuccino or uh, <laughs> the the brewed copy? <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, I love my cappuccino. You're right. And my mocha as well. My mocha. As well. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Here you I go. Like both. <laughs> I'm easy to please when you give me coffee. Oh yeah, I love you. <laughs> Excellent, Adam. Good question. And Joshua, okay. Good question. Thanks. <laughs> okay, so Joshua, have you come up with a question? Mm. Hold on. <laughs> wait, 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 hold on. Um Adam, are you um sorry. Ad Adam is 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 Sikina going to wh when when Sikina is going to the party? When oh. is Sikina going to the party? 
Oh, is that correct? Or I think oh, no, no. I'm, no, no, no. I'm Go, saying the wrong to, thing. No, no, going to is correct, but is there any possible way you can use another verb with the ing, not going to? Or... Like a verb and then you have the ing. When, when is she attend? When um, is Sikina... Uh, when is Sikina going to attend the party? When is Sikina... Oh, it's, not, it's, uh, it's, it's, it's wrong again. Yeah, ha ah. ha have another try. Take your time. Have another try. Try with uh, have. Mm. Have. 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 Oh, okay, have. Um. Mm. Well, this one, Adam, it's to use the to be verb. So the to be verb is yes, either... Yes, but uh, is Sikina uh, having her... When is Sikina having her... Um, Dinner party. Oh, you meant having with the ing. Oh, sorry. Yes. yes. Yes, that's very good. Yeah. Yeah, that's 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 the one. Excellent. Thank <laughs> you, Adam. Adam's a pro at this. <laughs> thanks, thanks, Adam. You saved me day. <laughs> You're welcome. Yeah, but now, Joshua, I want you to think of another one. <laughs> oh, I thought I already <laughs> I already been saved. Now, Joshua, okay. I want you to leave this lesson knowing the future. Yeah. Okay, I will give you a minute to think of one, okay? How is that? I don't want to put you on the spot. So have a think of using a future question to ask Adam or some. Okay, okay. I'm not I will use, don't be using Adam. have. Um, um, Adam, are you going to the party as well? Going to again. Oh, not going to, yes. yeah. Are you I know attending the party as well? <laughs> yes, I think I I'm attending at uh, her party because uh, she invited me. Excellent, very good. Are wow, you why did you invite and her? I, and I will okay. bring a cake. Oh, his apple pie. Why, yeah. <laughs> why did you invite Adam? I'm not invited. <laughs> <laughs> Well, uh, Joshua, <laughs> you came late. <laughs> all the invitations are given away now. I've given them all to some. I've given some um, away. So I've given one to some and Adam. And then now there's no more left for Joshua. I'm so sorry, Joshua. However, wow. I will put you on the special list and then you can come. But you have, you'll have to bring something. Maybe buy me coffee. Coffee. Maybe. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> Now that is your condition. You have to buy me coffee. A good one now. A nice cup of coffee. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Excellent. Right. So are you attending the party this weekend? Don't forget your optional time phrase. Okay. Very good. Attending. Excellent, Joshua. You passed. That's, okay. That's good. Thanks. You're welcome. Okay, guys. So do we have any questions? Some um, any questions before we move on to the article? No, but I can I cannot see the two Japanese classmates. You say oh, what? Yeah. Oh no. You see, no, my my hangouts. I'm only getting this now that when they have actually logged off. Oh. Yeah, you're right, Sam. Just realize because with my hangouts, I don't see who's leaving because I'm on another article. Oh. Um, but yeah, well, there's probably a reason. I think you know, um, Keo he had learned future before, and um, I think I'm assuming that um, Atsoro um, was still a beginner, so maybe it was too much for him. I'm not sure. Yeah, it's, probably, it's a first time. The first maybe, lesson. Maybe he is scared. He is yeah, scared. maybe he's a bit nervous. Yeah, uh, scared and nervous. Yeah. But, you know, they will overcome that. They will overcome that. Yes. Yeah, eventually, definitely. Kalinga after will... Love. Yes, after well, love, I cannot overcome. <laughs> Sorry, what was that sum after? I, I, I typed to you. Oh, yeah, please type to me. That's always better. Yeah. I'm just having a hearing problem. I think there is something wrong with my hearing. I'm getting old. Okay, guys. So while you're typing some, 
I cannot overcome yet. <laughs> <laughs> Sam, you're doing so well. You really are. Yeah. You're improving you. so much. Well done. Okay. So, guys, article time. And it's all about Harry Potter. Okay. And I will um, send you guys the link. When you guys are ready, we can open it. <clears throat> oh, yeah, Keo said goodbye in the blue chat, guys. So, yeah, he had to go. Okay. So, who would like to start reading? Who wants to be... Of course, Adam, whenever you are ready. Uh, with the premiere of Harry Potter and uh, the De Deathly Hallows, Part 2, uh, the adventures of the boy wizard and his friends come to an, uh, to an end. Uh, since uh, 1997, seven books and eight movies have uh, captured the, the attention of millions of uh, young young. Youngsters? Youngsters, Youngsters yeah. yes. And adults uh, around the world. Uh, the story may have come to an end, but Harry Potter and friends are still with us. John Rowling, the author of the, bo of the books, is shifting to the internet. Pottermore is a new website uh, in which Rowling wants, wants to publish new material and uh, give fans insights into the lives of the characters. Potter, Potter fans hope that Rowling might continue writing and come up with a, a character that is as likable as the boy wizard. Excellent, uh, Adam. Very good reading, I must say. Have you been practicing? Uh, I mm, read more than uh, speak. <laughs> oh, that's really good, Adam. Keep it up, keep it up. Okay, um, who would like to read the next part? I'll let you guys all read. Okay, Sam, whenever you're ready. The story may have come to an end, but how it Oh, Sam, sorry, sorry to interrupt you, Sam, but this one here, the fastest, this is okay. where you're going to start, uh, yeah. Yes, okay. are still with us. Uh, uh, Julian Rowling, the author of the books, is uh, the giving to the internet. Furthermore, is a new uh, website in which Rowling wants to publish new material and give uh, fans insights into the lives of the characters. For the fans hope that Rowling might continue writing and come up with a character that is uh, Likeable as to the boy, uh, wizard. Wizard, wizard. Wizard. Yeah. Okay, you want to read this one, Sam? This was meant to be your passage. You want to read this one? This part? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you want to try again? It's up to you. Okay, okay. Okay, uh, good practice, good practice. The the uh, fastest selling box series of the past has uh, broken all records more than uh, 400 million copies of uh, Harry Potter has, has been sold in uh, uh, 67 languages around the world. When Rowling finished her first team um, man, manuscript, uh, she, had, yes, she hardly found a published uh, who was interested in, then she has earned about uh, 1.5 billion from two, uh, 2001 when the first film was released and until the present movies goes have paid a total of uh, 6 billion at the box office. Excellent. Just one word, Sam. Goers. Yeah. This one. This one is pronounced goers. Goers. Okay. Yeah, I have a question. Is that yes, Adam. Mm -hmm. go goers is that people who went uh, on the movie? Yes, that's right. Oh, okay. It's just another word for people. 
they use goers. It's very uncommon, this um, <laughs> word. We don't usually say it. <clears throat> so don't worry about using that word, okay? Um, okay, who would like to read the next part? And there you go. There's Harry Potter himself. <clears throat> don't be shy, guys. Okay, I will continue. Okay. Uh, the success of Harry Potter is a mixture of many elements. The boy wizard and his friends live in both a real and magical world. Rowling uh, combines the real life in England with Ho Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardy. Uh, oh, sorry, Wizard Dry. Uh, more than uh, one once they uh, meet. Evil, evil, evil characters. So evil, yes, evil, evil, yeah. Evil characters and find ways to uh, defeat them. For many youngsters, Harry Potter is a boy they grew up with and a character they in the fight with. Excellent, excellent. Okay, if nobody else wants to read, does anyone else want to read? No? Okay. Adam, you want to continue reading then? Okay. Okay. Uh, in a world full of multimedia and uh, the internet, getting youngsters to read is no a small task, but Rowling has achieved nothing less. She hopes that uh, young people uh, who grew up reading Harry Potter will pass the books on the next on to the next generation. For the main actors of uh, of the Har of the Potter films, Daniel uh, Radcliffe, Emma Watson, and Rupert Grint, stardom has come uh, faster than normal. Their feelings are mixed. Daniel Radcliffe is relieved relieved that this, uh, the series o is over, whereas Emma Watson describes her feelings as bittersweet. Not uh, everyone sees Harry Potter is a positive light. Some critics say that the later books and films have become increasingly darker and more evil. And nevertheless, even though the Harry Potter story uh, has come to a close, uh, Pottermania lives on. Magic wands, uh, Potter clothes and uh, other Hogwarts items are sold at uh, a value of millions of dollars every year in Orlando, Florida. A new wizardy theme park, theme, theme park, theme, theme park, theme. wizardy theme park opened in 2010. Excellent, excellent reading, Adam. I must say. Um. Okay, guys. Any words? Any vocab? You guys are unsure of. Have you guys heard of bittersweet? No, I, I wanted to ask you about that. Yes, let's have a look at bittersweet. Now, bittersweet is just you oh. feel happy and sad at the same time. So it's in regarding to uh, it, it's in regards to your feelings. You're feeling happy and sad at the same time. I'm sure you guys have felt that. You know, you feel happy and then you feel sad as well. <laughs> <laughs> That's happened to me a few times anyway. <laughs> um, nevertheless, nevertheless, meaning all the same, all the same. Um, insight. Have you guys heard of insight? I've also seen insight here. Where is insight? First time to hear insight. See? Give fans insights into their lives of the characters. No. Okay, so insights, it's a better understanding of something. Better understanding of something. Okay. Um, defeat. You guys heard of defeat? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Billion. You guys know what billion is? Yes. A thousand million, okay. Um, manuscript. Mm -hmm. Manuscript. No? Okay. Manuscript, it's just the story of a book, any type of book, before it's published. 
So it's kind of the rough copy of something before it's published into a book. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, okay, guys, so if you don't have any questions, we will move on to the discussion questions, okay? Same questions again. I have a question. Of course, Joshua. Um, you said before bittersweet. Mm -hmm. What What about you eating mango and then you you feel happy while eating mango, but the mango is very sour. <laughs> <laughs> well, then you be like happy sour. <laughs> <laughs> so I should be happy sour. <laughs> happy sour. No, that's just me making that up. No, that doesn't even make sense. <laughs> You can say you can say bittersweet. You can say you're happy eating well. it. You're happy eating the mango, but then you're sad that it's actually becoming little because you're eating Sour. it. All. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you couldn't really say bitter sour. No. The, ex the expression. Can you say you can... uh, sour sweet? Sour sweet, yeah, or sweet and yeah. sour. Sweet and sweet sour. And... <laughs> <laughs> I think that's the that's the the ketchup with the with the um chili in it, yeah. Sweet yes. and sour. You know the Chinese food you get and they have um sweet and sour chicken. It's lovely. Yeah. It's it's sweet and it's sour at the same time. Oh it's delicious. So <laughs> that's a prime example for you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's good. Cool. <laughs> Joshua, you and your random questions, I must say. Okay, now quickly, guys, we'll have to move on to the discussion questions. I want you guys to answer them for me. Okay, so first question, I will give it to Sam. Okay, Sam? Um, okay. Okay. I'm going to watch Harry Potter with my parents tonight. So, Sam, I want you to ask me question, a question relating to the future. So, I'm telling you, Sam, I'm going to watch Harry Potter with my parents tonight. Is there anything else you want to know about what I'm going to do? Sam? Okay, who would like to uh, who would like to ask that question? I will try. Okay, Adam. Uh, who uh, who are you going to watch this movie with? Excellent, very good. Yeah, I'm going to watch it with my parents. Okay. Okay, next question. Okay, I'm going to the theater next month. I can't wait. I am so excited. Who has a question? Are you yes, excited Joshua. to see the are you excited to watch the theater? Excited, excited, ED, ED. Are you excited? Are you excited to watch the are you excited you excited Remember to watch future? the future? Future Our future future. Are you are you exciting? Mm, <laughs> is that correct? <laughs> or yes. is it exciting to watch the movie? <laughs> to watch the theater? Is that correct? Is it exciting to watch the theater? Um, and then your time phrase? Next week. <laughs> mm, I, I'm kind of looking for questions like... Um, Okay, who who are you going to go with? Okay, ah, um, right. who are you going to go w with? Will you bring food to the theater? Will you see your friends at the theater, etc.? Et will you take so questions time? like that? Yeah. Maybe ask something about my friends. Maybe you want to know who I'm going with. <laughs> <laughs> okay, who is you going? Um, are you going with your friends? Am I going with my friends? Good. Yes, I'm going with my friends. Okay, good. That's good. I might rent some DVDs out. So, Sam, can I give this one to you? Are you back, Sam? Yeah? 
Okay. Oh, yes. Okay, question is I am telling you some what I am doing at the weekend. So I am going to rent some DVDs out to watch them. Can you ask me a question in relation to future? Uh, will you going to um, see the DVD movie um, on the next, uh, next week? Can I ask I, you like that? Yes, but yes, but what about using what I've told you? I'm going to get some DVDs and watch them. Hmm. My answer is in correct. Yeah, you can maybe ask me because I, I'm telling you some. I'm going to um, rent some DVDs out to watch them. Maybe you want to ask, um, will you watch them with your friends? Oh. oh. Example, oh. yeah. Oh. Yes. Can you think of yeah. another question? Okay. Yeah. Uh, uh, will you... Uh, will you watch uh, the DVD? Uh, the DVD with your uh, fathers or sisters? With my fathers or sisters? No, I don't think so, Sam. I probably watch them with my friends. Yeah, my friends. Ooh, yes. Yeah. I'm okay, sorry. Sam. Yes. That's will perfect. Very good, Sam. Very good. Miss, Miss, uh, may I ask you a question? Uh huh. Uh, do you feel exciting and have challenge challenge to teach uh, teach your classmates? Yes, yes. <laughs> I love teaching my classmates, and I love the challenge as well. It's great. It's rewarding. Rewarding. Yes. Knowing uh, that my students hopefully are learning things in my lesson. <laughs> <laughs> I try to I try, I I try to say more. Yes, that's good. It's good, Sam. It's good. Keep practicing. Keep practicing, okay? Okay, um, thank you. Now, guys, I have another class after this if you want to join me. But um, you need to check the level to see if you are equipped to do it. Um, but if not, then I will see you soon. I'll have to go now and prepare for my next lesson. So all the best, guys. And it was great to see you guys again and hope to see you soon. Okay? Bye okay, for thanks. now. Thank you. Bye. Bye.